Hey guys and welcome back to IT News. In today's video we'll be talking about one of the biggest streamers in the game and we'll be finding out why Ninja has sort of disappeared in a way. But first we need you guys to help out by turning that like button blue and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Turn on notifications too so you don't miss out on our future videos we post. Alrighty, let's just jump into this. The biggest streamer in the world, Ninja, has made bigger waves in the gaming industry when he signed an extremely lucrative contract with Microsoft's streaming platform called Mixer. It was reported that the deal earned him a handsome $30 million as he was prized away from Twitch, where he established a strong fanbase. His move to Mixer has come as a surprise. One, because of how less popular it was com compared to the other stream services like Twitch and YouTube gaming and even Facebook gaming. Goddamn Facebook. But the money was good and Ninja was excited for the prospect of being the face of Mixer and hoping that it will grow as much as the other platforms. He was signed to Mixer alongside Shroud as Mixer tried to get the platform to the top of the food chain. But things didn't go quite as planned for him, especially not for Mixer themselves. They were not able to gain a big enough audience for the platform and it was just unable to garner a large amount of users to the platform. That's why it was announced that in June, the platform would be no more and would end up somehow merging with Facebook Gaming. This news came to us a shock in some respects to streamers on the platform as this was a main source of income and now they're forced to go on a new platform and build a new audience from scratch. For Ninja, it's not too detrimental as his stock is really high. He is a free agent and has definitely many suitors including Twitch, the platform he left at not the greatest terms. Amidst the news of Mixer shutting down, Ninja donated thousands of dollars to streamers on Mixer to help them as much as he could. Since then, Ninja streamed onto YouTube and that stream did incredible as he pulled a massive 160,000 co-current viewers within the first 20 minutes of the stream. That's about 160,000 more people that care about me. <laughs> He's really returned with a bang but he hasn't signed with them yet. In fact, Ninja is currently negotiating with a few streaming platforms and for sure that'll take lots of money for him to sign. You could expect a massive bidding war from other platforms just to get his signature. One of the offers on the table is a massive $60 million deal to sign with Facebook Gaming. Ninja has since declined that offer as he didn't really want to team his brand with uh, Facebook moms. It is good money of course, but in the long term it wouldn't be great for his brand. In the future, he wouldn't be able to negotiate any similar big deals like that in the future so it, it seems to be a smart decision by Ninja as he's thinking ahead. Taking the lucrative $60 million deal to Facebook Gaming will just look like a cash grab for Ninja. So you can tell he's taking his time and trying to make the right decision for the brand in the long term. Other than that, things have been pretty quiet from the Ninja camp. He's barely streamed since the end of Mixer and he hasn't done anything of note. Like that time where he tried to make people floss. Ah, uh, uh, let's not, let's just not remember that at all. How, how, do you, how do you forget something? It's likely because he's working on something big in secret, of course, you know, just to surprise us. We all expect him to be signing off to another platform, but which platform still remains a mystery at this time? The likely candidates at this point is YouTube Gaming, Twitch, even though Ninja and Twitch are not at the greatest terms. But there is no doubt that Twitch still holds a special place in his heart. It's a platform where his, his name was literally born. While YouTube is rapidly on the rise, he has, shown, he has shown that YouTube actually has a decent amount of people on there, as you can see by literally his first stream. The fact that he has over 24 million subscribers on his YouTube channel is a great base for him. He doesn't need to do that much of rebuilding at all. But platforms make sense in their own ways, but in the end, he'll have to make one decision. All eyes are on him and we'll wait for his big decision. And hopefully, he, he, he shouldn't mess up like last time. We hope that explains why Ninja has disappeared for the last few months, I guess and what he was up to. Which platform do you think Ninja will sign up with? Let us know down in the comments below. That wraps it up for today's video guys, thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy then make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. But anyway, we'll see you guys in the next video and until then, I've been YT News and uh, yeah, until then, see you later.